Welcome to our Tips and Tricks video. Today I'm going to show you a new CAD feature from Esprit 2016 called Edit Fillet. With this new feature, you can edit fillets, remove fillets, and create spline curves from fillets. Let's start with selecting fillet faces to edit. To select faces you want to edit, open Grouping Properties on the Edit Toolbar. This function can help to select multiple faces with ease. Go to Face. There are several options for selecting faces. For fillets, the best choice is usually a long parametric. Now, hold the Shift key and select one face by clicking the left mouse button. The parametric lines will appear. If these lines are in the wrong direction, you can change them by clicking the right mouse button. They are in the right direction now, so press the left mouse button while continuing to hold the Shift key. As you can see, all faces are selected. After selecting the fillet faces to edit, go to the Solid Modeler toolbar and select Edit Fillet. As you can see, the current radius is displayed on each selected face. Now, let's click Change Fillet Radius. Press OK. That's all! So it's no longer necessary to go back to the CAD file for this type of revision. When you are working with a bull nose and belt, you often don't need fillets in the model because the tool's radius will automatically create them while making the cut. In this case, or any other time you want to remove fillets, use the Edit Fillet function. Open Edit Fillet again and pick Remove Fillet. Esprit will delete the fillets and leave a sharp corner. Another new function is creating a spine curve. This new function is an easy way to create a tool orientation profile for a 5-axis operation. Select all of the fillets again, turn on the tool, choose Create Spine Curve, and press OK. Esprit creates a spine curve around the fillet. Thanks for watching our tips and tricks video about the new Edit Fillet feature. I hope you all enjoyed it. See you next time and visit EspritCam.com for more information about Esprit.